singing was a way of releasing tension. So we did a lot of singing. A lot of the songs came from old spirituals. They just changed the words to fit whatever was going on at that time. As we got on the bus, I had an idea for a new stanza, Pride on the Prize. Riding on this big gray hound, carrying love from town to town. Keep your eyes on the prize, hold on. And everybody started singing along with me, and that's what we sang as we got on the bus. There were different songs that we were singing to fit the occasion. Uh, for example, one of the songs we would sing would go like, uh, Ain't gonna let nobody turn me around, turn me around, turn me around. Ain't gonna let nobody turn me around. I'm gonna keep on a walking, keep on a talking, walking up the King's Highway. Ain't gonna let nobody do it. Turn me around, turn me around, turn me around. Ain't gonna let nobody do it. You're under arrest for refusing to obey my order. You get to the prison, oh God, get out with this rifle drawn. And he says something like, sing your goddamn freedom songs now. Sing your goddamn freedom songs now. I'm taking the Greyhound bus to Jackson this time. I'm right in the front seat and I'll do it every time. Hallelujah, I'm a traveling. Hallelujah, ain't it fine? Hallelujah, I'm a traveling down freedom's main line. Because I wouldn't stop singing, I got put in solitary confinement three different times. We had a small group in our jail cell, and we had a quartet, and I was part of the quartet, and we would sing to the ladies late at night when things were quiet. I know, I know we'll meet again. I know, I know we'll meet again. I know. I'll know we'll meet again someday. Ooh. The reason for that singing was to let them know that we were okay. And then they would sing back to us and they would let us know that they were okay. You could hear each other back and forth. You, you felt a little bit in touch. But if they wanted to stop our singing or control our behavior, they would take the mattresses. And we say, you can take our mattress, oh yes. You can take our mattress, oh yes. We start piling up the mattress at the door so they wouldn't have any problem. So they, you know, we were with the program. We were going to still sing. And we continued to sing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Music put us in harmony with each other, gave us support for each other, and we relish the opportunity. Even if you didn't have a great voice, it didn't matter, you could hum, and so everybody could sing. Singing, the music became a powerful, nonviolent instrument. And I often say, without music, without the singing, we would have lost a sense of solidarity. It gave us hope in a time of hopelessness. Hallelujah, ain't it fine? Hallelujah, I'm a traveling down freedom's main line.